All right, so uh, that's the second part of the show. Um, that is the Omi Hubu Sports Quiz. Uh, we have two, um, I mean, schools here. Um, that is Globin School and also uh, Bila uh, Memorial uh, Future Leaders School. And yeah, I mean, exciting people there, and we love it. But having said that, we'll be speaking with uh, one gentleman, uh, Franklin Nadu, who is uh, repping. Uh, Globe in school. Yes. Uh, I think I got it right. Yes, Franklin Kwesi Duama. Franklin Kwesi Duama, yeah, rapping Globe in school. You're the uh, you're a teacher, isn't it? Yes, I'm the head of head of upper primary and head of sports and entertainment. Oh, lovely! Head of upper primary and head of sports and entertainment. That is absolutely great. Uh, but then uh, you've brought your kids here uh, to participate in the uh, Omi Hubu Sports Quiz. How how good are they? Oh, they are very good. Mm. We chose the best of the best. So oh, wow. We are presenting you the best of the best from Globin School. The best of the yes. best from Globin School. And they are uh, coming f all from uh, uh, Tabora number two. Uh, we have Teshi also in here. So it's a battle between Teshi and also Tabora number so two. Let's see how it goes. Home and away. We home are, and away. We are the home team. <laughs> you are the home team. Yeah, absolutely. They are the home team. So it's just like a, a Champions League uh, game. The home team and the away team. And uh, probably I'm sure we'll get them back again for the away and home again. But then, um, uh, Franklin, tell us, uh, I mean, your school, tell us something brief about Globin School. So Globin School is um, a, G a GS approved educational institution mm. which was established in uh, on 18th march 1996 okay. by mrs gloria bin okay she's currently our director okay now and um we are driven by three core values mm. we have pans pans which is an acronym for politeness mm. for ambition for neatness and also for serene environment wow. then we also are driven by uh, academic excellence mm. and we also have small class sizes mm. that aid teaching and learning. Mm. All right. And uh, why you should bring your child to Globin School? Mm. It's because Globin School, it uh, as I said, uh, provides a serene environment, which is conducive for the training and um, learning of children in a holistic way okay. to make them uh, analytical thinkers. All right. One thing you can find in uh, some of the um, facilities you can find in Globin School. We have a mini zoo, we have a well stocked library, oh. we also have a, a computer lab, we have a science lab, and we have an e learning center for, the, uh, for uh, our preschool learners. Oh, okay. And um, I can see, I can go yeah, on I'm and sure, on. And I'm on. sure you can go on and on and on, but because of time, yes. uh, we'll just uh, take a pause here. Okay. Uh, but then, I mean, uh, if, if you have a word, certainly uh, if you're uh, around the uh, environs of Tabora number no. two and even La Paz. I mean, Globin School certainly is uh, the place to be. You can take your word there. They will, be, they will give your word better treatment. Um, so, uh, if you're around the environs of La Paz, um, Tabora, or uh, Kashiman, or whatever, Globin School is the best for you. But we'll be taking a quick turn. When we come back, we'll hear from another teacher from uh, Bila Memorial. Um, yeah, B uh, Bila Memorial School as well. So we're taking a quick turn. And when we come back, we hear from a rep from Bila Memorial School. Please don't move the muscle at all. All right, so you can see that yeah, they are even given a round of applause because we have the head of the school of uh, Bila uh, Mahmood uh, Memorial uh, Future Leader School, who is here, and she go by the name Mabel Akpo. I mean, uh, I mean, thanks, thanks for I mean joining the school or joining the uh, students here to witness how uh, they are going to excite you on the show. Uh, how confident are you in them? <laughs> Um, when we talk about sports, I'm not there at all. Mm. My mind is always on academics. Yeah. So I actually talked to the sports teacher to bring them back. Okay. 
okay. he's kind of busy so i said okay let me bring them my stuff mm -hmm. and then my school is an ngo school okay so our it's focus, an right? yeah, it's in Labadi, yeah. actually, actually. Okay, la, so our focus is to cater for street kids and then the less privileged mm. so i don't know how well they will be good at this sports but i believe in them you believe that in them. they can do something absolutely. so i said okay let me bring them and then let's see how it goes all right absolutely she uh, certainly believes in them and that is um, the, uh, the school that uh, bila uh, mahmoud memorial um, lead, um, leaders yeah leaders school uh, there and uh, yeah the the head is here mabel Akpo. she says she believes in them let's see if certainly she does believe in them we'll be taking a quick break when we come back we get we delve straight into the omi hubi sports quiz please do stay with us All right, welcome back to the Omi Hubiwu Sports Quiz. And uh, yes, on my uh, immediate right, I have Hussena and I also have Felix here uh, from uh, Bila Mahmoud uh, Memorial Leaders School. And she is representing Globin. And so, very shortly, we will be uh, diving into um, the questions. And you said you're a Manchester United fan. Uh, Felix, which team do you support? Juventus. You support Juventus. I mean, since when? Juventus, yes, <laughs> yeah, they've been there for a very long time. But then, uh, since when did you, did you start? Last year. Mm. <laughs> since when? Last, Last season. Year. Okay. All right, great. So, um, you will look on the screens for your question. Okay. Um, so, let me start with you, the very first question. And it will be displayed on the screens right about now. So what what we do is that the first one is bonus. You can either um, you can also either um, ask your friends behind you or your colleagues behind you also answer the question. And if you don't get it right, we can pass it on for a bonus question. If you also don't get it right, Felix, we can also pass it on mm -hmm. for a bonus question. But your very first mm -hmm. question is here. Let's take a look at it. All right. So which of these is the captain of the Black Stars? Which of these? As the captain of the Black Stars, we have A. Asamoah Jean, B. Andre Dere Ayu, C. Jordan Ayu, and D. Mubarak Wakasu. Andre Dere Ayu. Andre Dere Ayu is the captain of the Black Stars. Give it up for her. <laughs> Great. So your major question, Felix, uh, coming from Bila and Mahmoud Memorial Leader School, and your question is here. So which as uh, the head coach of the Ghana national team, the head coach of the Ghana national team, we have A, uh, Charles K. Akuno, B, we have Kwesia PRC, we have Ruben Menz, and D, we have Maxwell Kunidu. Charles K. Akuno. Charles K. Akuno is the correct answer. Give it up for him. <laughs> Charles K. Akuno is the correct answer. And so, your next question uh, comes now. Uh, it's here for the Globin School. Let's take a look at the question. So which of these teams won the Ghana Premier League and MTN FA Cup this season? Which of these teams won the Ghana Premier League and MTN FA Cup this season? We have A, Okwehu, A, Okwehu United, B, we have Asante Kotoko, C, Accra Hartsofolk, and D, Dreams FC. Anybody of you can answer? Hartsofolk. Um, Hartsofolk, you're sure about that? He is sure and certainly how to focus the correct answer they won the MTN Africa and also won the Ghana Premier League 2020-2021 season. Felix, for Bilia Mahmoud, your major question. And it is here. Let's take a look at it. Which club won the UEFA Champions League last season? A. Chelsea, B. Manchester City, C. Manchester United, and D. Liverpool. Chelsea. B. Ch a. Chelsea. Final answer is Chelsea. Right, so final answer Chelsea and Chelsea as a correct answer, they won um, the UEFA Champions League against Manchester City in Portugal at the Stadio Dugardao by a goal to Nakanketi of Kai Havertz. Mm -hmm. Okay, 
club in school, your major question, and that's here. Let's take a look at it. All right, in which country was the recent Tokyo 2020 Olympics held? In which country? Japan. In Japan. Uh, let's have a question again. A, Japan, B, Cameroon, C, USA, France, D. Uh, but she chose Japan. A, and Japan is a correct answer. Tokyo 2020 was held in Japan. And so the next question, or the major question for uh, Felix is here. And let's take a look at it. How many medals did Ghana win in the Tokyo 2020 Olympics? A, one, B, three, C, two, and D, none, zero. One. One. One is A and one is the correct answer. It was only one. Uh, that was the bronze uh, chucked by Samo Techi and becoming the very first uh, athlete to have won a medal in the Olympics for the first time in 29 years. So one is the correct answer. And so your major question coming to you, Globin. You guys are doing amazing. Wow. Nobody has actually had their question wrong. But let's take a look at it. Let's see what question we have here. Uh, who among these individuals is a boxing legend in Ghana? Who among these individuals is a boxing legend in Ghana? A. Azuma Kwate. Uh, B. We have Abed Nego Tete. C. We have Azuma Nelson. And D. Abedi Ayo Pele. Azuma Nelson. Azuma Nelson. Let's take a look at it. Azuma Nelson is C. And Azuma Nelson is the correct answer. He as one boxer legend we have here. I mean, there was nobody stopping us in the 90s. He was absolutely incredible boxer. And he rose the Ghana flag high when it comes to boxing. Now, Felix, your major question coming. How are you feeling? <laughs> normal. Great. He said he's feeling normal. Let's see if the question certainly is a normal question for him. And the question says that Messi Tego is a Ghanaian female legend noted for a football. B, Ampe, C, swimming, and D, wrestling. Football. Messi, Tego, Kwaku, noted for football. football. He's a football legend. And indeed, Messi, Tego, Kwaku is a football legend. He once played for uh, the women's national team uh, back in 1999. Uh, she featured for the women's national team. And so, Messi, Tego, Kwaku is certainly noted for football. And she also is a coach. Yeah, she's also a coach uh, for Berry Ladies team and also the women's national team as well. So certainly she's noted for football. And this concludes the end of round one. How are you feeling, Globe in school? Mm. You're feeling tense, are you? But you've got all your questions right. Mm -hmm. All right, so Felix, uh, okay, I, actually what I'm hearing is that this, uh, uh, before the very last question of round one, but then Felix and your guys there, how are you feeling? Are you good? Yes. Are you feeling tense? Is it okay? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Great. And your team, Globin School, what are you also feeling? Fine. You're feeling? You're feeling great? Yes. All right, so this is the very last question. Let's take a look at the very last question for the Globin School. And this question says that pick the odd one out. Pick the odd one out. A, Leeds United, B, Arsenal, C, Derby County, and D, Real Zaragoza. Pick the odd one out. Real Zaragoza. Real Zaragoza. Final answer. Real Zaragoza is correct. And indeed, it's the odd one out because Leeds United, Derby County, Arsenal are all teams found in the English Premier League. Real Zaragoza is found in Spain. Great. Great. Real last question before we end round one goes to uh, Felix, who is rapping um, Bila Mahmoud Memorial. Uh, leader school. Let's take a look at it. Pick the odd one out. Sevilla, Espanol, Leon, Aiba. Which is the odd one? Aiba. Sevilla, Espanol, Leon, Aiba. And you pick D, D, final answer? Yeah. Final yeah. answer D. Aiba is wrong. Because Aiba, Sevilla, and Espanol. Sorry, sorry. I should have given you bonus, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry about that. But then the odd one out is Lyon. Lyon is a French team. Uh, they play uh, in France. But Sevilla, Espanol, and Aiba represent Spain. So it's wrong. But sorry, I didn't give you the bonus. I'm very sorry. So that concludes the end of round one. But give it up for yourself. You've done an amazing job. An incredible one. An incredible one.
right great so we're taking a quick time when we come up we give it the results for round one and then we proceed to round two please just stay with us All right, so um, and it's getting interesting and getting absolutely exhilarating here in the studios uh, of Omi because at the end of round one, Bilal, um, I mean Bilal Mahmoud Memorial Futures Leader School had 20 points. Give it up for them. <laughs> and Globin School had 25 points. Give it up for them. Incredible job, incredible job. All right, so we are going straight into round two, and I'm going to start off with Bila Mahmoud, Future Stars, uh, I mean Leaders School, and Felix. That is your question for round two. Let's take a look at it now. All right, so identify the player in the shot. Identify the player. Who is this player? Abedi Ayu Pele. Wow, Phyllis had it correct. It's Abedi Ayu Pele, uh, the Ghana legend, and he won. Uh, I mean, won the Afcon for Ghana uh, in Libya, and also he won the UEFA Champions League with Marseille in 1993. And so Abedi Ayu Pele is the correct answer. Your next question, Glowing School. Let's have a look at it. Identify the player in your shot. Who player is this? Anybody of you? I talk an answer. Uh, Emmanuel Adebayo. Wow, Emmanuel Shea Adebayo is a correct answer. He once played for Arsenal. There you see that in the Arsenal jersey. He's uh, at some point also played for Manchester City. Also Tottenham Hotspur. Moved back to move to play for Real Madrid in Spain. He is a Togolese. And Emmanuel Adebayo is the correct answer. Your major question, Felix. Let's have a look at it. Come, come. All right. So, which African national team is this? African national team. Which African national team is this? Have a look at it very carefully. Nigeria. Nigeria. Yeah. Nigeria. Okay, we have Ahmed Musa, we have Vincent Inyama, we have Mikel Obi, and so Nigeria is the current answer. Give it up for them. Right, so your major question, Globe in School, and it's here. Yeah, let's take a look at it. Which African national team is this? Egypt. How quick! <laughs> right, we have Mohamed Salah in the. Uh, we have uh, Mohamed El Neni also in the whole place for Arsenal. Passing you also in the. Uh, Gazi also in the. And yeah, certainly the correct answer is Egypt. Look at them. Quick! All three of them answered it correctly. Egypt is the correct answer. Your major question, Bila Mahmoud, future leader school. Let's have a look at it. Spearheaded by Felix. Alright, which tournament trophy is this? UEFA Champions League. It's quick and true, UEFA Champions League. And the current holders are Chelsea, who won it uh, last season, where they beat Manchester City by a goal. So, the UEFA Champions League is the correct answer. Global school, your next question, your major question. How are you feeling? Great, certainly they are feeling great. Let's have a look at their question, which will be displayed now. Which tournament trophy is this? This is scary, is it? So the Afcon. The Afcon. You think it's correct? Yes. Final answer, Afcon. Yes. Why won't I give it to them? Because the final answer is the Afcon trophy, and give it up for them. The Global School are doing such uh, immensely well, and that is the Afcon trophy. That is the Afcon trophy. Right, I, I mean, tell you what, I mean, these guys were really selected to be here because they are absolutely incredible. And why won't you take your world to the school? Why won't you take them to Global School or take them to Bela uh, uh, Future? Uh, I mean, Leader School. I mean, they are doing such an amazing job. We talk of sports, they are absolutely incredible. And sports also is next to education, and so you should, I mean, take your world to any of these schools wherever they are found and they are i mean golden i mean global school actually found in tabora 
uh, number two. So anyway, La Paz, uh, Akuman, uh, I mean, Kashima, you should take your word there if your word isn't doing much well in education, I mean, in educational aspect and also in sport, you should take them there. And also uh, in Teshi, Labadi, um, the environs, if you want to uh, have, or you want to be very, very good at sport and also uh, in, <laughs> uh, in education as well, I mean, certainly the place to be. S. Bila Mahmoud Future Leader School. Okay, having said that, your major question is here, and let's have a look at your major question. Mention the sports in the picture. Mm -hmm. uh, as for Felix, Taekwondo. 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 Are you sure you're, are you sure you're correct? Yeah. He's sure, he wasn't certain by sure, but then that is the correct answer. Taekwondo is the correct answer. Give it up for him. Taekwondo is the correct answer. And so, Globe in School, that is your major question. Let's have a look at it. Mention the sports in this picture. Mm -hmm. High jump. High jump. Final answer high jump. He said yes, and so, yes, high jump is the correct answer. So give it up for them. He was under pressure, but then he <laughs> came out to say the correct thing. All right, so your next question, Felix. Bila Mahmood, a Memorial Future Leader School. And what sporting tool is in the photo? What sporting tool? Tennis bat. Tennis bat, give it up for him. Tennis bat is correct. Tennis bat is correct. All right, so let's have a look at your major question, Globe in School. Let's have a look at it. What sport into is in the photo? A golf club. Golf club. Golf club, but that is a golf stick, but golf is correct, so let's give it to them. Teachers are really teaching them something good. The teachers are really, I mean, I drove my heart for uh, Mr. Franklin. He's doing an incredible job. And also, Ms. Uh, Madam Mabel is also doing such an amazing job. Let's take a quick break. When we come back, we bring you the results of round two as well. Please, just stay there. interested in but before then let me tell you that the tie has broken and because there's nothing to separate between those two and round two because both of them have 25 each give it up for them <laughs> incredible and so this uh, as i said earlier this the parts i really enjoy the most because they are going to pick and act and i ended up with you right so Usena is starting this one. You're going to pick and you act. You pick from this 
very first ball. So come and pick, you show it to me, and then you ask what it's in it. You pick one. Right. See, who's in it? So look into the camera and I can it. What is it? Tennis. Tennis is correct. Give it up for it. Tennis is the correct one. Step forward. Golf. Golf is correct. Give it up for them. Yeah. So you can have you can have your place. Golf is correct. Uh, that is okay. So come, come pick. Can you pick your phone yet? A goalkeeper. Never. No. no. Come again. A goalkeeper saving a ball. A goalkeeper saving a shot. A, a shot. Yeah. No. Who's an energy receiver? You saw it. But it looks like you're not telling them what they should say. Oh, come, come, have a second look at it. Come, have a second look at it. Look at them. Look at them because they can't see you. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Yeah. Your last because time is up. Would you want to say something? No idea. All right, but that is goalkeeper's gloves, and it looks like is not. I mean, doing right, the right thing. All right. All right. All right. Give it up for it. Done the job. So forward. Pick this one. Show it to me. Can you do it? <laughs> you can't do it. Try, 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 try. Look at them. Boxing. Boxing glove. Boxing glove is correct. Give it up for them. <laughs> Whoa. Well, boxing gloves is the right one. So we said, I come forward and pick the three, the third one. In the middle, this one. This one. Pick one. Can you see me? Swimming pool. Swimming pool! Give it up for him! Swimming pool is the correct answer. Step forward. Step forward. Pick it up. In the middle. Yeah. No, look at them, look at them, Minati. Look at them. Oh, would you like to change? Can you do it or you want him, someone to come? Alright, so you come. Come and look at it. Come and look at it. Yeah. Can you see it? 
It's this. It's this. So you, you know it? This is S. So you know it? Okay. So I just put it. So Felix, you, you'll be the one to answer. Okay. Uh. You still cannot get it? Wow. Polisa, can I give a bonus? Can I give as a bonus? Because they can't see it properly. Yeah, that's what they're saying, but I'm even telling them. Oh, should, should, it, should it be a bonus? Probably the other school can. Yeah. Oh, okay, so bonus question. So come, come forward. So forward. Yeah. Are you seen it? Alright, so I'll tell it to you. The football stadium. Football stadium is correct! Wow! The first chance, and they have it. So, who's going your major question to you? Come pick it up from here. Football stadium, the last one, no, the last one. Yeah. Football stadium. Correct. Yeah. Wow. Cristiano Ronaldo. Cristiano Ronaldo. <laughs> Amazing. Step forward and pick it up. This is interesting. Let me see. No, he's in it. He's in it. Can you ask him? Can you ask like him? Act. Yeah. So, so act, act. No, just go into the center. Yeah, so act it. Act like him and let me see. Act, act. Act like him. Oh, you, okay, you come, come and, come and have a look at it if you want to. <laughs> come and have a look at it. <laughs> can you act? You can act like him. Well, it's difficult. So should I pass it for a bonus? <laughs> try, try, do something. I mean, something. you just do something. You, you might not know, maybe they, they might get it, so try and do something. Okay? Can't. All right, bonus. Come, Lucina. Let's see if. Okay. As someone does. Whoa! I'm absolutely living. I just absolutely cannot understand how they are getting this. This is incredible. Wow. Global school are amazing. I mean, give it up for them again. Give it up for them. They are amazing. So your major question, come pick it up. How are they? The last one, number five. Wow. You see now you are just pretty. Okay. Every free. Look at her carefully. Alright. I refuse to share card. A red card. A yellow card. I feel whistling in the whistle. Or a foul. But so, uh, producer, can I, can I? Okay, all right. Time is up. Time is up. Who knows who is coming? Who is coming? Wow. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay. Are you giving a foul? Are you showing a card? Bonus time is up. Mm -hmm. I think you guys are close, or you guys were close, but it's a referee showing a red card. So probably you do this, you indicate that you or you, you understand. So you show the card, you so you, you get me. Alright, so your major one, pick it up from you. Yeah, come. Dead one. Open it. Simi. No. Would you like to try? Would you like to come, come, step forward and come and try? Step forward. Can you try? Try. <laughs> no, time is up. Bonus. Who's saying I come and see if you can try this one? Bruno <laughs> Stam is up. I, 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 I can't give it to you, but I mean, I mean, give it up for them. Give it up for them. But it's a player scoring a penalty. But you score the goal, why don't you jubilate? For them to know that the player scored the penalty. I mean, clap, clap for us. You guys have done an amazing job. An incredible job. Incredible job. Incredible job. Incredible job. I mean, Felix and also uh, Usena has done. Uh, such an amazing, and also all of them uh, behind um, their uh, I mean, contestants, they've done absolutely amazing. Their teachers are incredible. I mean, Oscar, uh, or also Franklin, and also Mabel have done. Carlos, sorry, it's Carlos, not Oscar. So, Carlos, Franklin, and also Mabel have done an amazing job. We're doing a quick time when we come back. We'll give you um, that score for the final round. Please do stay with us. All right, so welcome back to the Omi Hubi Sports Quiz. And at the end of the final round, uh, from round one, round two, round three, uh, Bila Mahmoud Memorial Future Leaders had 55 points. Give it up for them. Uh, 
and then Global School, who are crowned champions, had 70 points. So without further Alright, so uh, the host of pretty much Papa Ace of Forgive will be doing that presentation. So let's welcome Papa Ace of Forgive on the set. Alright, so there you have it, Felix receiving it. So Papa Ace of Forgive giving up everything for them. And they have done an incredible job. So that is Sevilla Mahmoud Memorial Future Leader School. And then also Sama will be presenting it to uh, the winning school, that is Globin School. Give it up for them. They are also located in Abora number two. Sama is a news anchor here at Omi Television. All right, so amazing. Give it up for them. Give it up for them. They've done an incredible yeah, job. We're done, we're done, we're done. All right, great, great. You guys have, have done an amazing job. Give it up for them, give it up for them, give it up for them, give it up for them. All right, so let's have a chit-chat before we, we say bye-bye to the show. But first of all, how are you feeling? Feeling great? You guys are so, so amazing. You guys are so amazing, wow. Yeah, keep it up, keep it up. You guys are doing an incredible job, keep it up. And also, Felix and your brothers, how are you guys also feeling? You didn't do bad at all. You didn't do bad at all. You guys also did a great job. And so, uh, Felix represented uh, Bila Mahmood Memorial uh, Future Leader School. And so, yeah, you can get in touch with them if you want to contact uh, Bila uh, Mahmood Memorial Future Leader School. Their numbers are 54 Zero five four seven zero five eight two seven one, and also for Globin School, who are also located in Tabora Number Two, their numbers uh, is zero two four two six four one zero three one zero two four two six four one zero three one. And so, those who also want to participate to also get in touch with Omi Television, and we will have your students here to have an exciting quiz. Give it up for yourself. We're done. An amazing job. Don't forget, after here, we have refreshments for um, the student as well. But then a massive, massive thank you to uh, Franklin and also Mabel and also Carlos as well. They, Carlos Franklin, representing Golden, uh, I mean, Globin School, and also Mabel, who is the, um, the head of Villa Mahmood Memorial Future Middle School. On this note, I'll say thanks to the entire production crew and for myself, Derek Ayun. Let's enjoy the rest of your week. Bye bye. Give it up for them.